Hi, it's your friend Mike, and this is Do It For Me. I actually found this game because I came across a video by its developer named Lixian, and he talks about how he made it in under 24 hours. So if you're interested in that, I'm gonna go ahead and leave a link to that video in the description below, as well as a link to the game. So, uh, let's give it a look, huh? I looked into her eyes. I couldn't say no. I don't see her eyes. <laughs> Do it for me, she said. And so I did. Okay, A and D to move. W and space to jump. Pretty standard. Who's that up there? Alright, hold the jump button to hold jump higher. Touch the hearts to collect them. Alright. Left mouse to attack the woofles. The woofles. So I'm not gonna lie, I did watch uh, Lixian's video, so I know how this goes. See? I know that mechanic there, the, uh, once you collect a heart, a platform disappears. So, pretty cool. So this game, uh, it was made for Bracky's Game Jam, number two. And, uh, the theme was Love is Blind, so I want to see how that ties in. Um, in the video, he talks about how, like, it's kind of a, a metaphor. Like, if you go around collecting hearts, some other pets, they, uh, they aren't possible anymore. So that's, uh, you know... I guess love is kind of like that. See? Right there. Just like that. See? That path is no longer available because I took that heart. So I'm going to restart it. And I'm going to try to uh, get all the hearts anyway. So I'm going to do this. We're going to be kind of a player. We're going to try to get as many hearts as we can. While still completing the game. And since we're pro gamers over here. Oh! What is that? Oh, so we have 6 of 23 hearts. Should we try to get them all? Let's try to get them all. Got him. Aha. Oh, God. So that got rid of all of my platforms. Okay, so I just went ahead and restarted there. So I'm not going to kill that guy. What I will do is grab all the hearts, though. Boom. Pro gamers. Oh, shit. That was quite a transition. I can't do that because that platform disappeared. I need it, so I'm going to wait. I'm going to grab this one. There we go. Can't stop us, dude. Ooh, how am I? Okay, so I got to go all the way up there first. I I'm on to this. So, I would, I would recommend really going and uh, checking out that video on how he made this, because it's really cool. Uh, he talked about how he had some issues with the camera, like when you switch. Uh, he really likes this, this pathway system where the camera follows you through the stages. Rather than loading up a whole new one. So, it, it's just cool hearing the process that some of these game devs go through when they're making these games. That's why I follow a lot of them, and I try to expose you guys to as many of them as I can. And that's why indie games are kind of the focus of my channel. You know, you really get into the process of it, and it's pretty interesting. And what are these lockers? Locker 17, for some reason? Oh! Oh my god, I almost died there. But I'm too quick! Ooh. What is going on here? There's like a lot of, uh, like a filter over the screen. Oh! Killed that guy. Fuck! Ooh. It was him or me. Alright, alright, here we go. Finesse, dude! Once he moves- Ah, oh, god! I gotta jump once that guy moves. All right. Ooh. Finesse, dude. It's all about that finesse. Oh, I gotta get that heart, though. Duh! How am I supposed to do that? How am I supposed to do There's gotta be a way to do that. 
There we go. Okay, so I'm gonna jump from this one. All the way over. Ah, I gotta wait. Okay. Alright, I get it. Alright, now we're gonna get it. Fuck. I'm being too cocky here. Kill. Wait. Don't kill. God, okay, alright, I get it. Hold on, guys. Hold on. Hold on. There we go, okay. Gotta be kinda smart for this one. Lucky I'm a genius, you know, certified. God! <laughs> Just as I say it. Come on. If this is what it takes. This is what it takes. There we go. Ooh! Alright, here we go. Oh, this filter is creepy, so I see the horror elements coming to play here. Oh, I see a kill counter up here, too. Um, maybe I should be killing them all. Uh oh. Okay, so this is a bit tricky. Okay, there we go. Pro gamers over here. See, that one took a little brain power, but... Oh no, then this guy's up here. How am I gonna get to that? Do I have to wait for him to be over here? Okay, I gotcha. I gotcha. Okay. Ah, oh, fuck. I trapped myself again. There we go. Okay, so that guy drops down. Or, you know what I could do? Instead of collecting it outright, I could do this. Hold on. Check this out. I'm a genius. Watch this. Watch this. See, I can approach this from a different way. From a different way than I suggested earlier, because now... I'm using my thinking parts. Boom. Not using my thinking parts hard enough. Hold on. Hold on. This is it. This is how we do it. This is how we do it. See, I was thinking this game was too easy until here. You gotta really think about it. Fuck. We're okay. There it is. There we go. 23 of 23 hearts. We got them all. Okay, we got all the hearts. Oh, that's a dead person. And there's another dead person. And there's a whole bunch of dead people. Uh, and these lockers are all labeled 17, and I think this is that girl, um... I looked into her eyes, I realized what I had done. Do it for me, she said. And I did. Not all of it, but I did. Teenager's dead because of me. How can I live with myself? I wanted to blame her, but it's my fault blood is on my hands. I hear the sirens outside. Please don't do it, she screams in fear. Oh my god, she's... Hands in the air. She played me. She used me. Before the cops got close to me, she whispers... You should have killed all of them. You got the puppet ending. Okay, yeah, I do feel used. Do It For Me, a game by Lixian, art programming music by Lixian, and additional art by Fabio Pinto. He does mention Fabio in his video as well. Made with Unity and other software that I cannot pronounce. Thank you for playing. This game was made... This game was created for the Brackies Game Jam. The theme of the jam was Love is Blind. The development of the jam version was made live and with the help of my viewers. Thank you to every single one who joined the streams.
Alright, so that was do it for me. I really enjoyed that game. It had a nice dark twist at the end that I wasn't expecting. And I really liked that mechanic, how it was like a metaphor for love, where you take the heart and then you can't take another path. And I thought that was really cool. So um, if you want to get some of the other endings, I encourage you to download the game and play it for yourself. I'm going to leave that in the description as well as a link to that video that I was talking about earlier. So thank you all so much for watching, and I'll see you in the next video. Bye.